The new update for The Witcher 3 came out, and among a lot of new stuff, now we have access to both armors from Henry Cavill's Geralt, meaning both the Season 1 and Season 2 armors. But before we can actually wear these armors, there are some stuff that we need to do. So let's get to it. Alright, first things first. Make sure that Geralt is at least at character level 20, because if he isn't, you won't be able to wear the armor nor use the swords of the set so if you are not at least at character level 20 you can do some of the things that i'm about to tell you meaning the quests and all that but you won't be able to actually wear the armor with that out of the way get yourself to this location shown on the map right here this location is called the devil's pit it's between melbury dale and stonecutter settlement when you get here, you will see a priest of eternal fire screaming for help. Once you talk to him, he will say that he needs you to do something for him. When you decide to help him, the game will give you a quest named In the Eternal Fire's Shadow. Track this quest and make your way into the pit where you will have to defeat some of these thugs. So go ahead and do just that. Once you're done with that, get down here where you will see the entrance to this cave. Open the door and get inside. Head to the location that I'm showing you in the video and pick up this note which belongs to a guy named Reynold. Read it and move on to this next door where you will find another note. After the cutscene, continue along your way and you will see this wolf school insignia. Examine the area a bit, you can use the magic lamp that you got from Kira Metz on these lights as well if you want to see what was going on around here, if you have completed her quest. It's completely optional though. Once you're done with all of that, Go on ahead and head down right here and continue your way. Go straight forward until you reach this place where the voice tells you to go right. But you shouldn't do that. Matter of fact, you should head left here where you can see the insignia on the floor. Continue your way and you will reach another note from Reynold. Pick it up and read it. Also, you can break this wall and examine behind it if you want. Continue this way where you will see another insignia. We're trying to follow the insignia around if you haven't figured that out by now. Go straight ahead and you will see this friendly guy, which leads you to a cutscene if you decide to touch him. Never mind that, let's get a move on. Go straight ahead and climb up when you reach this location. And what do you know, another insignia, which means you're going the right way, obviously. Get inside this kind of a lab place and you will find another note. Pick that up and read it. This is getting kind of repetitive, isn't it? Just bear with me here, we're almost done with the insignias and notes. Get out of that lab and jump your way across here and keep moving straight. When you reach this place, you see a purple light. Go towards it and you will find another note from Reynold. By now Geralt knows that this Reynold had a friend named Osmond, which is basically kinda important in this quest, trust me. Go on straight ahead and jump down where you will be attacked by four plague victims. Fighting them will not be that tough, just use Quen and you'll be alright. Once you're done with them, get on this piece of wood, make a run for it, and jump across. Once you do that, you will see this door that you should open using art. Get in and pick up our next note. Once you're done with the cutscene, go on ahead and open this menu and head to the bestiary. Head down to Spectres and find the red miasmal in this section. You will find out that this creature is vulnerable against Reynolds filter, which is what we're going to make right now. The game will now give you an optional quest to make this filter. So just head to Alchemy and open the quest section and there you will find it. If you have the required ingredients, then I suggest you make this thing because it will come quite handy in the next few minutes. If you don't have the ingredients, well, do not fret. Remember that making this filter is optional. Alright, now that we are done with that, go on ahead and just follow the route. In your way, you will be attacked by plague victims again, so keep an eye out on that. At the end of your way, and when you defeated all of the plague victims, you will find this door, where we will also find the last note from Reynold. Open the door and inside we will find Reynold, who is wearing Henry Cavill's armor, actually. If you want to make that filter, this is your last chance. Okay, go on ahead and use R than this guy. If you have not made that filter, you are going to fight this guy right now. But if you have, you will get to talk to him first. If you are talking to him, choose both of the white dialogues first. Then choose not giving you the potion. Now that the fighting has started, your best strategy, in my opinion, is to parry his attacks and then attack him when he's stunned. You can also use Irden to weaken him. After you defeat him, you will have to fight the red miasmal. Fighting it will not be that tough actually, it's pretty slow, so you can dodge its attacks and then attack it. Using Irden and Quen is also recommended for this fight, and also remember that it will spawn plague victims as well. 
Once it is defeated, you will get to talk to Reynold, the real him this time. Again, make sure to choose the white dialogues first, then the yellow ones. Once you choose the first yellow dialogue, you will obtain the diagrams to the forgotten woven set, which is basically Henry Cavill's armors and swords. How you will decide to end this guy's fate is completely up to you. Do as you see fit. I personally chose this option. Now that we are done with that quest, we have another quest named Scavenger Hunt Forgotten Wolf School Gear Diagrams, which basically gives us the diagrams to upgrade this set to higher levels. But in order for you to be able to actually get these next diagrams, first you have to get yourself to Kaer Morhen. So if you haven't reached the point in the story where you go to Kaer Morhen and you haven't unlocked this area yet, you have to continue the story until you reach this point, otherwise you can't get these next diagrams. And to be fair, you won't be needing them until that point either. In other words, you will be able to craft the armor and swords right now, but you won't be able to upgrade them. Keep in mind that you will need to be at least at character level 34 and 40 to be able to wear these upgraded sets. Moving on. So, for those of you who can go to Kaer Morhen, just get yourself inside of the castle, head to this small library right here and climb up this ladder and pick up these two notes and read both of them. Now you have unlocked the Master Crafted and the Grand Master upgrades for this set. The basic level of this set and the Master Crafted one are the armor from Season 1, and the Grand Master level is basically the armor from Season 2. And there you have it, my friends. You can now start crafting the armor and the swords, but remember that you will need to first make the first one, then the master craft it, and then you will be able to craft the grand master level and gain all of the armor's potential. And also, you can't just go to any craftsman in this game to craft Witcher's armors if you don't know how crafting in this game works. But if you have access to this guy right here in Toussaint, you can use his skills to craft all of the stuff that we just found. This guy is basically the ultimate craftsman in this game. But if you don't know how or where to craft stuff like this in The Witcher 3 or you still haven't started the Blood and Wine DLC and don't have access to Toussaint, I have made this video right here that will completely explain how to find the craftsmen in this game and how to complete their specific quests and how to gain their services, so make sure to check that video out. But as always, I hope that this video was helpful to you. If it was, make sure to leave a like and consider subscribing. Take care, for now.